Welcome back to Old Man Gaming. Here we are, still in Leaderboard 28. And uh, at least some of you had said you wanted to see as much as possible uh, in regards to bulldozing. And so that's what we're going to do. I don't need the lights on. I might need some, uh, some fuel. Let's go take... Oh, this is what I want. Stop. There we go. Oh yeah, we need some fuel. So I've marked the road where I want to make over there, as you can see. That's actually somewhat important. I'm wondering if I should drill it further down. Um, like I'll show you, because on the map I can't really... Oh, I could go a little further down. We could do that one. That gives me an idea where to dig. Almost the same place I started the road before, so. And I did use that road, just not as much as I thought I might, because I uh, I didn't get any of the... Frankenstein, so me, I guess I could have pulled it all the way up there, but because we're not going to be using this right now, where am I at? I think we just switched one. Yes, we did. Okay. So we got some gold in the... I was going to... I was starting to dig last night. It had to stop. So... Uh, I'll get back to that. All right. But you can see I had to clean out 608 ounces. It's... It's decent. Uh... I was hoping for a lot more, actually, but, you know, it is what it is. Somewhat middle of the day. It's okay. I think uh, once I, especially once I get through this season, which we've got six days to winter, um, <clears throat> I'm going to dig mostly at night, probably, because we get a bigger bonus for digging at night. So, some people would just start, they'd put the drip thing down and try to go from here. And it's it's not going to work. Got all this dirt in the way. I want to get over here where it's kind of flat, flatter. Just start digging towards my... I like to have a, a little bit dug out because then you can see what level you need to get down to to make it kind of worth your while. And also the shorter, you know, like you don't have to go too far. Get... Just making sure it's nice and flat. There. Whoa, whoa, no, 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 no. Ooh. <laughs> Almost. You gotta be careful, man. <laughs> right there at the edge. Alright, so I'm gonna... Just turn in here and do this part as well. Now, if you really want a ramp that goes all the way down, you have to start, like, it's probably 20 or 30 blocks long. It's actually kind of ridiculous. <laughs> so, I, I might try something with the uh, front end loader. If I can, uh, once I get to it. I think we're going to stop there. I am making this bigger, because I do plan to have the Frankensteins out now. Uh, I almost have enough money to buy at least one and a half. Pens, uh, we're kind of near the end of the season, so they they will be getting cheaper. Why does that seem like it's, yeah, it's a little uneven. So now I'm going to turn around and do the same thing this way.
here we may not make it through. Yeah, we're getting stuck. But if you just bounce the uh, blade, then it often will get through. This is why you want to start when it's not too deep. So if you get a wall of dirt that goes over the bulldozer's blade, it will definitely stop you. And you won't be able to go any further. So. So let's back up more. Making sure it's down. This doesn't have to be too perfect. I guess we're going to just start digging it. So here, wondering if we now press down, let's just see. Get it to kind of be a little... That's better. See, we've already cut a little out. In fact, what I might do now that I've done that, see, this is, we need to get this side going. I still haven't gotten all the workers. Like the last worker I got was uh, something I didn't need. I don't even remember what it was. All right, so what I'm going to do is, uh, oops, not yet. We're going to flatten this a little bit, and then we'll do something. Since we got this square, it's a good marker. I know I just bulldozed that flat or, like, lower, but, all right, so we'll start it on this side. So now I'm going to actually bulldoze it down some i'm going to just make sure i start kind of in the same spot with every line i don't want to fall off the edge though I know I did this differently last time. And I think, whoa, it might have actually worked out better then, but. We're going to try it this way, too. We're going to first bulldoze this down. All to the same kind of level here. The end. I'm going to turn around and and bulldoze it flat from the like lowest uh, area here. So you'll see here, like, it doesn't get too low. You can clearly see that the angle, I mean, there's a little bit of a drop, but not as much as, they could definitely make it so it goes further down. Give it a, another percentage or two on the grade. I mean, the dump truck can certainly handle it. <laughs> So I went from a further distance, and now it's going to be a little, uh, it might be a little deeper. Well, actually, it wasn't my intention. And I've always said this, I like to bulldoze in the day, because at night, everything is just a little bit more difficult. Just tough to see, really. Just re bulldozing it because we've gone down like kind of a layer. All right, we'll get rid of this bump and then we'll turn around and bring everything down. Kind of flattening out this area at the 
back here. Uh, so I've got room to start and go forward. By the time we get to the other side, we'll see we've actually cut down quite a bit. But it hasn't, like, been too tough either. We just continually move small amounts of dirt. Uh, you know, the, this doesn't get stuck. And uh, at least not too much. And it's pretty fast, actually. It should be able to move this much dirt. Honestly, this is a little bit lame that it's having issues. We only have to get through this one, like, uh, set. Because then you're always pushing only a portion of the dirt. I thought we were, like, making a hill here. And I'm going sideways. That happens. Now, I think I did fix my dead zone on my controller. See, it's kind of making a ramp up, and that's okay. You know, as you bump the uh, blade up and down, you kind of get a, a ramp going up. So our idea was to go down, right? The idea is now we push most of the dirt all the way forward. And now we can come back down to where it's level not get stuck in our tracks here. Come on, this is like the annoying part. This is pretty flat, so I put the blade straight down. And I just push it forward again. But now we should be able to push it all to the front. Also, like, because there's a hole there, it will push the dirt all the way. You don't have these ugly walls. And it just makes a nice looking road. Currently now we have a pretty flat road all the way here. Um... And it's a little lower down than it used to be. You know, like if you look, it's maybe a meter and a half. Oh, we hit a bump, which means there might still be it's a little bit to push forward. All right, I think that's fine. All right, perfect. All right. And now just pushing forward, we can... Sometimes we don't take too much. You won't leave uh, a little bump on the other side, but it's really hard. And I'd rather cut off a lot and have to make a second round than uh, actually try to... I don't know, it's not really any faster because you're still making two runs. Whoa, not a great time for loading. And don't get stuck on this little hump here. It can get you messed up. to be a pretty big wall here. All right. Things are looking good. I'm just going to get rid of these. We'll cut off the rest here. It wouldn't even hurt if I did a little bit on this side already. Make pushing things around a little easier. Okay, and whoa, 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 stop, stop. There we go. 
I don't mind doing this. If you guys have questions and want to see something done, let me know. Like, is normally this takes, I don't know, most things take 10 or 15 minutes to show. And uh, it really helps all you guys out. And I don't mind doing it, you know, even though this is a competition and I should just be digging dirt anyway. But here I have to do this. So you might as well watch me do it. <laughs> So again, I'm just like I put the the uh, blade straight down. I don't push down. At least not now. But like when we came back, we did. And that's how we're down here a little ways. We might make a road further down so this is actually good but i'm not trying to make a road that i'm going to use the dump truck on i'm going to put some uh gosh i hate backing up it's always like difficult <laughs> all right starting to get it shouldn't be getting dark but it seems like it's getting dark Oh shoot, I am pushing down now. Oh, well, I guess we'll start that. So now I'm pushing down. You can see we're, we're gaining some depth again. Oh, I meant to just clean up that row I just made, but oh well. It's okay. We need to do this anyway. Let's get these lights on. Uh, let me do this. because This is just sitting here. That'll give us some light there, too. It's got enough. Oh, I should have went the other way. All right. I like using the vehicles for light rather than those big light things you buy at the at the store because uh, they actually give off more. Like, their light range is wider. At least I feel like it is. Maybe it's not, but... Come on. Let's get through this. We're already going down another half a meter here. That's nice. Oh, why did the game do this? Oh, I see. Um, be right back. Okay, well, I'm back. I didn't realize my Bluetooth headset was also connected to my phone at this moment. Normally I disconnect it so that I don't get interrupted like that, but it happens once in a while. I feel like we've missed some dirt here. No, we're not. Let's see. It's coming from this, this angle. There we go. We're gonna keep moving forward, okay? Now again, it's kind of pushing it up, but we'll get it all the way to the bottom. Seriously, you should be able to push it all the way. Not that much dirt. Well, this is the angle I like. But it, I do think I got my uh, dead zone fixed, at least for the most part. And... Uh, I had to use a program like uh, the like settings in Steam didn't seem to work as well as I thought they might. So, so now again, I'm pushing down or pushing dirt, and it's digging a ramp downwards towards. Once the dirt dirt once the dirt gets too much, then you know I'll flip flip the uh, blade up and down, and we can. Trying to get it all pushed forward. And we'll look, we're getting, yeah, that's a good drop down. But it's not enough. Not enough yet. So we'll have to figure out like a better way.
but we'll uh, continue our push downwards. Of course, we've got to, you know, we've still got a bit of dirt to even just move off of here and go down further, so we'll uh, pushing, maybe I'm pushing too much, I could take a little less off and keep rolling. I'm pressing down the whole time while we inch forward here and then if it stops then I'll We got too much of a like oh, we got a little bit over here but we can fix that That is what it is, you know. It will. Right there seems to be some. Garbage dirt we should get rid of off the side of the wall here. I do want this, uh, and I'll probably make it wider, but I do want the road pretty wide. Um because I'm going to fit a gas tank down the side near the uh, uh, Frankenstein. I don't know why I can't remember that word so well. Or name. Let's see. Now we can get both of these, hopefully, without creating any more, like, lumps. That's a good idea to start this when it's early. Um, and if you dig all that out, and you, you know, I don't know, right about there. You know, if you've dug it all out and then you start doing this, then uh, like the whole idea is kind of less useful you've already dug out all the gold you can dig much faster using this method you'll see once we get it all put together but this is looking like a nice road here Let's back it up and then I'm going to try, oh well, not try, we're going to then turn around and we're going to bulldoze straight or like flat, which should actually bring the top area down because I don't want to roll over the top of these. All right. at the end it's such a big old whoa I didn't want to do that it's okay we're at the end and it's not going to be a problem I 
It just looked a little uneven here, so fixing it. Let me see, so that's the dump truck. I wish the uh, excavator had better lights on it. It doesn't, as you can tell. I'll try, maybe I'll bring this over here. Um, just to, like, lighten up the whole road. Yeah, lots of light on the road. I like that. So. Plus, it's good for the video. You know, YouTube doesn't like dark videos for some reason. All right, so like I said, we're going to turn around. Because this is on an angle, once we start going flat, and we'll just back it right up to this wall. So the dozer's blade is flat now, not pushing down. So now we're digging again, actually down. And so now we can take one more pass going down and we should get pretty close to the dirt we want to get into once we can make this all flat. And it'll also have us flatter on the far side there so we match. So we don't have to like have that cliff there and fall off. Come on, move this dirt. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't do that, you thing. Oh, no. See, it's like making a ramp up. Which is okay, we'll come back in another iteration and have it all leveled out here momentarily. Let's see, we're already dropping again lower down to the almost same level of dirt here. What I'd like to see is somebody wants to work for you. I'm gonna be like, yes. And it'd actually be someone that's useful. <laughs> The last one was another, oh, it was like the drill. At least they could have given me like a guy that works in the excavator or actually the excavator would have been really good or the dump truck. No, they gave me the drill, which currently is just a freaking machine I'm using for light anymore for the most part. So I was just a little annoyed. be able to move it really with not much of a problem. Okay. Back here where we know it's pretty flat. like the next time we turn around and start uh, going back down as a ramp we'll have uh, pretty much what we're looking for because see we've already kind of hit the level of dirt out here I can clean that up with the bulldozer or not the bulldozer with the uh, excavator
next to me back all the way to the wall. So we can do this without creating a line on the other side. Too late, already getting it. At least we can push it all the way forward. It's not a big problem. Take care of this one here. Now we'll widen it out some more. Put that down. Trying to stay away from the wall so I don't grab more dirt. Although we are cutting, I might cut it back in here because. You can see we've like kind of missed the side there. We're That's fine. Alright, one more run down this, this side over here. This is looking great. We've only been at it for 30 minutes. In 30 minutes, like if you were using the excavator to do this, you wouldn't be very far to start with. And uh, you know, I could actually technically already get my excavator over here and start digging deeper into the pit if I want to. And, oh, I'm pushing down. I don't want to push down. I just want to go straight. I've already kind of started cutting. Not good. I think I'll turn around now and go go down. We'll see how close we get to the uh, top of the dirt over there. And I still got a bunch of squares that are, you know, full squares that need to. Other cog. That really on this thing? I haven't even had this for that long, man. I didn't want those cogs to go out. All right, I am. Wait a second, turn around here. I need to. You think once you got the bedrock, it would just disappear? No, it likes to create problems. Yeah, everything's almost about broken on this thing. Man, you irritate me. Just, that's a problem. Okay, why aren't we having it? I'm like stuck on something. There we go. What I do is just get enough room to turn around. To be honest. There we go. 
Okay, we'll just use the wall. <laughs> and then as far back as I can get, which is about this white line. Now I'm actually going to hold down the thing and we're going to start angling down again. And uh, this should give us pretty much the ramp we need to get down to where we need to get down to without too much trouble. I'm not pushing down right now, it just won't push it forward, so I'm trying to slowly find the level where it'll pull, push it forward, get some of the excess dirt out of the way, and then we'll come back. Whoa, whoa, don't make a mountain. Don't need a ski resort right now, my friend. Ski jump. We need... Alright, let's get back. We can kind of see it slowly going down here. Can you get off the wall there, man? Alright, so here it's kind of flattened out, which I don't know. I see a bump still over here. Get off the damn wall. Alright, let's start going. Didn't even get very far. Keep going. Trying to get the invisible stuff to be less, but uh, well, we can make it more. Come on. Really? How much dirt do you have in front of you? Like, nothing. Push the damn dirt, please. You now, some days, this thing just isn't working like it should. See, I had less dirt, it looked like, and it's like just having issues pushing. Like, look at the wall. Look how much we've come down. <laughs> That's really nice, you know. Once you master this with the bulldozer, man, nothing will stand in your way. You have all the places you want to dig at your fingertips. Oh crap, I didn't want to run into the wall and get a bunch of freaking dirt going. There's not much uh, left to go down. And if we dug one more block that way, we probably would be flat with this. Which is good enough for me. I don't really have a problem with it being fuel is low. It might be low, but it's not empty. You can just dig a little right there 
out and the bulldozer, I mean the uh, excavator could easily uh, then get in there and make a nice little ramp. I'm gonna just so there's like you know we always get halfway and it's already kind of have an issue. So I figure we'll just start halfway and then cleaning it up shouldn't be too much. All right. I'm gonna have to go buy some crap. So. Just now we got this big wall here. It will take some time to go through it. You don't want to take off too big of a chunk of a huge wall like that. Some up there. It's kind of weird. Yeah. Okay. Feel like we're getting somewhere. Let's go up here. Oh. This should be good enough to get Frankenstein at least, you know, we'll get, we need two at least. I think two should reach on down here. All right, here's where we're making the draw. Basically now it's just flattening it all out the way you want it. And, uh, Making it as wide as you want it. Now that I've done kind of forward stuff here. We move faster, we don't get stuck. It continues to widen out as we get down here. So come on, get it all the way back here. There we go. Yeah, I get used to the dirt disappearing just it is what it is we can't fix it i mean you can but like with the bulldozer because you're moving so much dirt it comes back so quick so i just learned to deal with it don't that bug me too much problem get off the wall so you're not pushing extra dirt I mean, it is widening it out a little bit, so it's not too bad. Okay. We should have this other one down for most of the... Oh. Oh, there's still more. There's so little. Now. Don't make more, please. God, why does it do this? You know, like... So dumb. Because there's, like, it just doesn't look like there's that much dirt. And then all of a sudden you're still pushing dirt everywhere.
I think I'll try to clear the, off the right side, or left side here. There wasn't, yeah, see, it only goes to about here. Yeah, I'm still making a mess. There was like three little freaking dots. The dirt. Man. I feel like I'm, am I ever going to get this like cleaned up and smooth? You will, but it's just, it's dumb that it, it keeps making these stupid mountains. Just that one was really fast, it went like down nearly instantly. The trick here is to not get too close to the wall because then you pull up more dirt. So that lump, well, I'm not going to leave it because although like when you drive the dump truck around, it'll definitely flat something out like that. All right, we're getting somewhere. Look at this. This is great. I think I'm going to do my same tactic here and like oops either way dig into the side here while we're close to the bottom clean it up so that fuel is good once the cog breaks I'll just well what I should do is drive it up towards the uh where the parts come in and park it there so it's like I don't have to pick up the parts anywhere so maybe I'll do that come on push it all the way back you can do it I can't even see where the little mountain is that it's made. Okay. Keeps getting skinnier and skinnier up here. here there's still quite a bit to do um, but it's just me I'm just gonna widen this up a bit really is all I need to do it is where you know it's as deep as I want it to go right now if I have to fix it in the future it'll be from you know down around here going forward to make it lower and so, um, see, cutting it out here at the bottom actually has helped out quite a lot. There we go. But again, I think I think that'll be video for now and uh, if you have other questions or more questions about you know this bulldozing definitely don't hesitate to ask as I will answer and I will give you a video if I need to it's nothing out of my way 
Uh, it's part of why I run the channel. If it's a game I play a lot and I know a lot about, I'd be happy to share the secrets I know. So don't be afraid or you know, don't feel like you're burdening me with questions because I'm in a competition right now. I don't. It doesn't bug me. But I am going to leave it here. So thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video and learned something, give it a like. If you're brand new, please subscribe. As always, thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one.